big scare for three New Hampshire kids who were home alone when a burglar broke in. And thanks to this piece of surveillance video, Londonderry police say they know exactly who they're looking for. A teenage girl was watching her younger siblings when the would-be thief broke in through the back door. As Ken McLeod shows us, the teen knew exactly what to do. So I would definitely do that door. A rattled neighbor wasted no time having her house sized up for a security system, worried about her kids after what happened next door. It's scarier to have it happen in broad daylight when their children are home. She's talking about yesterday afternoon when this guy knocked and rang the bell at a Litchfield Road home as a porch surveillance camera rolled. He peered through a window when no one answered and tried the locked front door in a way that wouldn't leave fingerprints. Confident nobody was home, the burglar made his way around back and pried open a sliding glass door. But it wasn't until he made his way upstairs that he realized three kids were at home, ages 13, 12, and 8. She saw him walking up the stairs. She screamed and she ran, locked herself in a bedroom with the two other children. That older sister then used her iPad to contact mom and dad, who were both working, and they called police. She did everything she could. She did everything exactly right and made the best of a bad situation. The suspect ran, but when Londonderry police went public with this image, a spate of tipsters, including his own family, agreed it was Ryan Noel, already on parole for drugs and theft. The whole thing struck a scary chord with neighbors. It makes me question, do we let them play outside today? Do we stay inside? Um, do we make sure everything's locked up every time we go for a walk? The burglary victims want no part of the spotlight. They put up this camera after a break-in last year. But police say the three youngsters got it right from the start. Don't answer the door unless you know who this person is for sure. Don't answer the door. Police are fairly certain Noel will follow that same advice as they hunt for him because a parole violation of this sort would likely send him to prison. In Londonderry, New Hampshire, Ken McLeod, WBZ News. The well, police aren't concerned that the children were left home alone, given that the two oldest are 13 and 12, but detectives do urge parents to make sure kids understand what to do if a stranger comes to the door.